Hello everybody and of course welcome back to Dickie's videos where no war game remains unplayed and we are back to Lance, Shield and Longbow, Field of Glory 2, Medieval is here and of course my second uh, show of the game as uh, literally as it comes. So here we have an, a mix of Anglo-Norman versus German West. This is just a uh, generic custom battle I just thought I'd select. So we're going to look at some more units of knights and all sorts of shenanigans that happen in here. Gotta say, really enjoying this game. Really hyped up for it, uh, for when everybody in the world plays it. So we're looking at an Anglo, uh, an Anglo-Saxon Norman list. Brilliant a mix. Not as many, uh, de, uh, you know, uh, knightly knights as you would imagine, but still a fantastic list nonetheless. As you can see, the rough ground is not going to favour our, of course, our. Uh, heavy troops, but of course we we can get over that. So we are of course the they are actually class knightly lancers still, even though they're not the full modelled figure of a uh, lance. We have that or sergeant. We've got the battle wagon, battle wagon. Don't know what it does, but battle wagon. That's the name of the video, battle wagon. Of course, we are going to go with... Oh, look at the models. So very nice. Dismounted. This list is going to be brutal. Uh, absolutely brutal for the Germans. So we've got to be careful, of course, this rough terrain on the right, where we're going to de probably deploy lots of our um, medium troops, our crossbowmen, uh, and any arch units we can stick on that hill uh, to fire down against the uh, Germans. So all the lancers are going to go to the left. All the archers are going to go to the right. Billowing crossbow and bow, you know that uh, as they de as they describe the crossbow as a unchristian weapon towards other Christians. Okay, so knights, 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 we're knights of the round table. Du -du 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 -du. Okay, so Welsh Burn, plenty of points left. Can we actually have any? Um, the masters have dismounted lances because these units are expensive, but they are brutal. I think we could have. Could have a unit of light archers there as well. So the plan of battle here is, of course, to take most of the sturdy foot troops on the left, push them forward with a battle wagon while the archers take that right side and defend. What will happen, we'll see. So I can add two more generals to my army. We're going to add a general to the battle wagon, Jeffra, and, of course, to the sergeants on the ground. We need to make sure I do... I, I remember last time I didn't actually do my command groups very well, uh, so we need to do that. And then, of course, uh, they will be, and the battle wagon will be in his own uh, little... Uh, and there we go. Knights to the left, archers to the right. And let's see what's going to happen. So... The German forces have arranged themselves into a battle line of knights and all sorts. Let's rush forwards as quickly as possible. We need to get over this piece of rough terrain on the left. Knights need to push forward on this left. Archers and dismounted lancers on the right. You see how that unit is very affected by that hill. and that It's a difficult slope actually and it is severely disordered. Let's see what they do here. They are stoic, so they're going to give me time to deploy, which is brilliant, and that's what I want. Let's advance our skirmish line up to this right. I think what's going to have to happen, unfortunately, we're not going to be able to advance as far as I want to. It's going to take these crossbowmen into a particularly unfavourable position on this right. But, saying that, they only have three canton spearmen and very weak units. But even with that, we could possibly move this, this unit to the right to defend against these knights. Let's see if that prompts the German forces to attack. Stoic. So what we're going to do, we're going to move these two units to the right while the archers come behind in a defensive formation. Everybody else forward. Let's take this dominant hill position on the right as soon as possible. Okay, the light archers now pushing forward to engage the Germans on the field. We're going to hit the cavalry on the right. Battle wagon! 
I love how it has actually does have a Christian cross on there as well, so that's quite cool. I like that. I like that little extra, an extra, a little red tapestry. It's all in the detail there, Richard. Okay, so this is going to be a dismounted lancer, heavy foot, shield, and armor. Okay, the crossbowmen now hitting my lances. Ooh, we can't have that. If we can drop the gem into there, we're going to field off against the archers there next turn. And everybody else is going to rush forward. Okay, we need to get over this hill as soon as possible. Absolutely loving this game. If you've not clicked that like and subscribe button yet or found the link on the Steam store, please do so now. So what we're going to do, we're going to punish these uh, knights on the right with archer fire. Good disruption there straight away. So what are the capabilities of the battle wagon? It's uh, defensive spearmen, uh, unless fragments fill your arm advantage, uh, unless... Uh, Plus 50 POA versus less armoured foot, unless heavy wagon up to 50 versus less armoured, well armoured. So we are superior armoured. So it's good against crap. Ooh. Remember, there are knights in the rear ready to reform. Charge on the left. Okay, let's decimate this unit. Brilliant charge. Getting a bit stuck there, and oh, we can't charge that unit type. Ooh. Oh, we're stuck in that rough terrain. That's not great. Okay, we'll charge there, and then what we'll do? Shift the general into there. Advance forward. Advance forward. I think we are slightly becoming a little bit over. Over. We'll win the impact here. We're going to have to charge here. Good choice. Oh, we're stuck with that battle wagon. It is the first time I've used it, so I do apologise. Oh, this is going to be bad. Gritted teeth. Here comes the charge from the raw spearman. Disruption. Got the POA of that hill right there. Disruption on their line. Oh, I think the knights are going to charge in, but I think they're blocked by my infantry on the right side. Answers oh, outnumbering us on the left. Hold the line, fellow Normans. A rally! Charge into the crossbowmen. Fortunately, fell back there. Charge into the lights on the left with you. Massively outnumbered here, unfortunately. Oh, fragmenting the raw spearmen. 
Oh, we're in a bit of a bad position here. Oh, slightly annoyed that cavalry unit ran away, but we can shoot over. Oh, power to the norm. Oh, they're flying. They're right as it's crumbled. <laughs> okay, move back. Let's use our overwhelming fire of crossbowmen and uh, longbowmen here. Let's see if he pushes me back here. So this is why I'm going to hold. Oh, we're in a bad position there. But a good position with the wagon. Okay, I think that's all we can do there. Here come the armoured knights. Oh, they're going to hurt us. Oh, a fallback. Brilliant. We can push our um, armoured lancers out of the rough terrain now. That was my bad movement, really. Oh my <laughs> The battle wagon failed. <laughs> okay, let's see if they break in that combat. Nope, and we're gonna have to charge in. Told that they're in a bad place now. Okay, so the lancers can the dismounted lancers can move out of the rough terrain. Oh, and we're going to move here, turn to the right. Absolutely amazing there. Okay, let's pummel this unit with fire. If I get a fragment, I'll be really happy. There's a lot of men in that um, unit there, unfortunately. Particularly owning the right side here now due to the combined arms. Remember, combined arms. I remember Richard Brody mentioning that uh, in the warfare. It's all about the mix of troops that could win the day. Unfortunately, the change in the POA now here that we lost the general. Oh, these are the two combats that are a bit ropey. Well, this one's ropey anyway. Ooh. Okay, we're just going to zone of control. Oh, no, we're going to sit here. But we are going to move our general to this unit to the right. And to the next turn. Blood and tears, armour, men of all kinds laid on this battle. Our unit on the left getting shot up by the crossbowmen. It's not a great day there for them. Flank charge. That unit's in a lot of trouble. Will it hold? No, unfortunately. Charged. Destroyed. I've noticed with Field of Glory Medieval that units don't evade or run that far. Oh, good disruption there. That battle wagon is brilliant. The centre line of the German forces now starting to crumble against the against the Normans spear. Absolutely fantastic. And we're gonna go for the flank here. The raw spearmen charging down the hill. Unfortunately, they rallied. <laughs> so I'm gonna try and shoot them back up. We're gonna try and shoot the um, the, the lances to the right. Good disruption there, brilliant. If we can advance forward, shoot these up again. Nope. Uh, 
we should have moved the general into that unit, but never mind. Okay, we're at a massive disadvantage here on that side of the hill. Unit is about to explode there. These flags are wonderful as well. Okay, we're going to try in the break here. No disruption, unfortunately. We're just going to turn to face to the left. Go to the next turn. And the battle wagon holding that centre line particularly well. Charge! So what unit type can the battle wagon charge? I'm assuming it's units less armoured. Oh, come on, break. Okay, so what we need to do here is engage here first. I know we're going to get flanked. I have to accept that fact. Push back there. Okay, we're going to shoot the knights to the right again. I think they're going to auto break very soon. Brilliant, that's what we need to see. Beautiful models, beautiful battlefield here. Let's just go around to look at that battle wagon. Look at the beautiful decals on the side of that. Absolutely marvellous. Okay, let's jump back straight into that battle, to the anarchy that is happening right now. Come on, this unit in the centre needs to break. Nope. We're about to get overflanked on that left side, unfortunately. And there's the auto break. Now we can pull the forces to the right, finish off these units as they run away. Okay, to the next turn. It's all going to end abruptly here, I can imagine it. Rally, rally for the enemy here. Here's the flank. Oh. Hold firm. We are, we are lancers though. I mean, sorry, we are dismounted lancers. It's about uh, knights and sergeants, sorry. So we are stronger. Can we break the centre before the cavalry on the left come hammering down? Okay, let's turn our uh, course to the cavalry there. Uh, sorry, to the crossbowmen. Let's walk down here, try and shoot these up. But we've got low ammo, unfortunately, so it might take us a while. Okay. Charge we go. We have to engage the crossbowmen now. I'm hoping these just explode. Which they are. Okay, we're going to send the longbowmen to the left side. Ready your dagger. Oh, wow. We're just going to move there. We're not going to engage because we'll, we'll absolutely get whooped. A win there, which is fantastic. Okay, we're just going to advance down the hill. They're going to hold there. Nothing else we can do, really. Starting to overstretch our force line here. Fragmented. Oh, the, the swordsmen there getting smashed up. Here's the charge. This is going to hurt us. Ooh. Hold firm, though. Brilliant. Ooh. 
more enemy cavalry to the left side. It's looking perilous for our cavalry holding that hill. I think the crossbowmen are actually advantaged because they are armoured as well. This could be game already. We could just be surviving at the nick of time. Come on, battle wagon. We can't actually engage anything. Okay, so this will this is really going to hurt them. So what we'll do? We'll we'll charge here. In we go, archers, change their direction. Because what I want to do is charge there when they change direction next turn. If we survive that long enough. Okay, battle wagon, just mosey on down. Oh, we're in trouble here, lads. We're in trouble. I think all our cavalry is about to die. Take deep breaths. <laughs> Rally again on the right side. Oh, it's the flank. No! My cavalry. Oh. Brutal. But the lines both ready to explode. Victory, victory. So, as you can see, ladies and gentlemen, the, the field is littered with dead armoured knights from both nations. What a field of battle here. The cavalry on that left side smashing me up. A couple more turns, that would have just absolutely collapsed. But I know a fantastic game of Field of Glory 2 Medial. If you've not clicked that like or subscribe button uh, by now, click it now. Also, check the link below to the Field of Glory 2 Medieval site. And of course, we will see you on another battlefield another day. Ha! Oh, that was Danger Close, Will Robinson. Danger Close. And bye-bye.